when you get up in the morning and got an attitude when you go down and lay down at night. Come on, somebody. The Micah, for all practical purposes, saw David dance and half naked before the ark and before God. And the Bible said she got an attitude and she despised David. Look out for the spirit that calls you to despise somebody else. That is a deadly spirit. Let me talk about that spirit for a minute. A spirit that calls you to despise somebody. In other words, you don't say it with your mouth, but you think it with your thoughts. And you receive it in your heart. And you say to yourself, look at him. You say to yourself, look at her. She thinks she's I don't think y'all understand me. People who despise people, it's something that they're doing they don't like because they ain't quite dignified as they are. They're not quite on the same level as they are. Now, you got to keep one thing in mind, that her attitude didn't just come about. She was a king's daughter, and she was used to living a certain way and dress a certain way, and had David, who was once a shepherd boy who understood the praises of God, who understood the heart of God, who know that God loves a cheerful heart, who understood that God loved the praises of his people. But she was too dignified to praise God. Some folks are just too holy to praise God. They think if they throw up both hands, come on somebody, that they must jump out. And they're going to offend God. God is interested in your mess. God is interested in your praise. It don't matter how you look like to somebody else as long as you're praising God. Let the world worry about must. The Bible said that David danced. Come on, somebody. I will dance like David dance. I will dance. Where the spirit of the Lord is upon my heart, I will dance like David. Hey, hey! Come on, church. I will dance. One more time. In the spirit of the Lord, on the front my heart, I will shout. Come on, church. I will Some of y'all didn't even want to dance. Y'all just look with, look at him up there dancing with his wife. That's my wife.
messing up Saul. David was having a good time. Getting all sweaty and gritty. Dust flying everywhere. But he was having a good time. God saw him dance. God saw him worshiping. God saw him glorifying his holy name. Let me just tell you something. Let me just tell you something. The Bible said when she despised David in her heart. See, most people don't think God can see in your heart. She didn't say it, but she despised him. The Bible said that God saw her despising him when she were peeping through the curtain. Look at somebody and say, peeping through the curtain. Peeping through the curtain. You might catch an attitude. Sometimes seeing things you ain't got no business seeing. Well, give you an attitude. Now, some of y'all going to forget this sermon. You're going to forget the, the good thing, but you're going to slight the other thing. But I'm here to tell you today that she didn't think God saw her, but God saw her. And then she tried to get sarcastic. I'm talking about attitude. When you get sarcastic, it's a poorest form of humor. It's an attitude that nobody likes. You don't have to be sarcastic because things don't go your way. But I'm here to tell you, you keep on being sarcastic. And you're going to wind up with Alzheimer's, dementia, bipolar, and tripolar. I just throw that in there for you. Some of y'all ain't never heard of tripolar. That means you got about three or four attitudes. You had the North Pole, South Pole, and look at somebody and say, I hope you're getting this. God saw her attitude and she mocked David and she was sarcastic. She told David, I saw you out there dancing with the people of the city. I saw you out there as a, as a king. You shouldn't be dressed like that. You shouldn't be looking like that. You shouldn't be behaving like that. And I love David's response. My God, David said, my people love me and I love my people. And David said, you and your daddy didn't call me, but God called me. And if I want to dance before the Lord, I will dance before the Lord. And if I want to praise before the Lord, I will praise before the Lord. Hey! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! stop you. That devil cry wants you to sit down. That devil cry wants you to be quiet. But when you learn to worship God, when you learn to praise God with the right attitude, when the praises go up, the blessings come down. I'm going to have to do a part two. Let me just tell you something. You see, she thought she was smart. She got an attitude and despised the man of God, the king who God anointed. Come on, somebody. And I want you to understand something, because... 
She despised.